How inhumane can a congressman be? During his time in the 112th Congress, Adam Kinzinger has voted anti-animal every time. Adam has received a score of zero by the Humane Society. As someone in the 16th district, what do you think about the fact that Adam Kinzinger scored a score of zero on the Humane Society's congressional scorecard? If he can't care about our animals, how can we expect him to care about our community? For almost 60 years, the Humane Society has been fighting for a humane and sustainable world for all animals. They are America's mainstream force against cruelty, exploitation, and neglect, as well as the most trusted voice in extolling the human-animal bond. They work to pass animal protection laws at the state and federal level to educate the public about animal protection issues and to support humane candidates for office. Their work is sorely needed. There are over 4,000 puppy mills in the United States, and they produce more than a half a million puppies every year. A puppy mill is a dog breeding operation in which the health and well-being of the dog is disregarded in order to maintain a low overhead and to maximize profits. At many of these puppy mills, the breeding dogs are kept in cages continuously as they breed litter after litter. In order to protect these defenseless creatures, the Humane Society has the 112th Congress for co-sponsors. His fellow Illinois Republicans, Judy Biggert and Tim Johnson, stepped up to co-sponsor the legislation. But, when the Humane Society asked Adam Kinzinger to support legislation to stop these puppy mills, he must have acted, right? Tears us up inside is the emotional trauma that these dogs go through. After all, what kind of person would allow animals to be kept in these deplorable conditions? No, Adam Kinzinger did nothing. Adam has co-sponsored 228 bills and resolutions in his time in the 112th Congress. So what kind of legislation is important enough for him to put his name on? Commemorative coins for Perv Putval, expressing support for National Eagle Scout Days. And Adam was even willing to protect his K Street donors' private jets to keep them away from the public record. He refused to come to the defense of these precious puppies and their abused moms. And what do you think that says about somebody's character if, if they don't care about protecting animals? They don't care about anything. <laughs> we need people in Congress who will protect animals. Adam Kinzinger is not one of those people. His zero rating shows a complete disregard for animal welfare. His actions on every animal issue from puppy mills to dog fighting to abusive factory farms demonstrate Kinzinger's passive support for the inhumane treatment of animals. He does not deserve your vote on Tuesday. You have a choice this November 6th. Elect Wanda Roll for Congress. <laughs>